What uh, do you think will happen in U.S.-Taiwan relations? But the United States will and should continue to provide defensive weapons for Taiwan. Uh, but the level of assistance should be directly related to the offensive threat. That is what the Shanghai 2 communique, which settled uh, at least temporarily uh, this burning issue a few months ago, uh, provides. Uh, on the Chinese side, looking at Peking, uh, it is important then if they want the level of arms to Taiwan reduced, they must reduce the threat. Uh, and the United States should continue to insist, uh, as we did in, in the Shanghai Communique in 1972, and this also is the line in all other statements between the two countries, uh, that the issue between Peking and Taipei be settled peacefully. There is another point that should be made. And that is, this is something that our friends in Taiwan and the friends of Taiwan and the United States have often overlooked, that the most indispensable factor in guaranteeing the security of Taiwan is a good relationship between the United States and Peking. If we have that relationship, that may restrain them. If Peking has a relationship like that with the Soviet Union, then Taiwan is in mortal danger. Uh, I do not see any solution working out in the near future, perhaps some sort of a commonwealth status in which Taiwan retains uh, its economic and social uh, character, as Hong Kong, of course, must as well. Maybe that will happen. I'm not prepared to say. But at the present time, we should keep the issue where it is. Taiwan is in no danger. It will continue to have its own economic system uh, and continue to prosper. Uh, and I think that uh, as long as uh, we do not provoke Peking uh, by either our statements or our actions in providing more than is needed for defense to Taiwan, Peking. They'll huff and puff, but they will do nothing. Do you think there's a danger that a Democratic or a, uh, a liberal Republican president would withdraw our support from Taiwan, and what would the impact of that be? Well, <laughs> there is the danger, but it would be a very great mistake. Uh, a great mistake, because uh, uh, if we, in effect, say to Peking, look here, we're withdrawing all our support, we're breaking our economic relations, which is what we really have at the present time, primarily, and whatever military support that we're giving, uh, it would simply encourage uh, Peking uh, to move on Taiwan, uh, to move on it, recognizing that they would have no problem as far as we're concerned. No, that's not the thing to do. I don't think it's going to happen for that reason, even though some might be tempted to do it.